With Kaveh and Baiju being announced as the next Dendro characters for Genshin Impact, I started to think about all the Dendro characters that Hoyaverse has recently came out with. And I don't know about you, but to me, I feel like they're pumping out Dendro characters extremely fast. And that's not to say it's a bad thing because every character plays in a very important role. And when you think about it, I think Hoyaverse covered every single character role for Dendro. We have Al Haytham, an on-field damage character. Nahida, that can also play on-field or off-field support. Kalei, another support. And now Yao Yao, being a healer. Now, what can we expect from the new characters? Obviously, nothing is confirmed yet, but Baiju being who he is, I think he may be a five-star healer. And while that sounds really cool, here's the downfall. Do we really need a five-star Dendro healer? We have Yao Yao, which is, in my opinion, good enough, and we got her for free. But for the average player, is it worth it? Do you think Hoyo versus coming out with too many Dendro characters, or are you fine with it considering it's the newest element?